Hello everyone! I am super excited. I wasn't expecting this, but Wow Box decided to send me another box of Japanese yummy treats! I'm so excited! I really, I hadn't like heard from them until they sent out this box again, so I was really excited. This video isn't technically sponsored. I'm not being paid to make this video, but I did get the box sent to me for free, but they do know and clearly they're okay with me giving my 100% honest opinions. Wow Box, if you've never heard of it before, for. They do seem to ship one of these out every single month, so it's a monthly subscription service. There are four different types of plans you can choose from, so that'll affect what the kinds of treats in each box are going to be. And then based off of that, you can pick your different size. You can select the regular box size, which will have 7 to 10 items in it, or else you can get the large box size, and that will have 10 to 14 items in it. So there will also be a price difference there, and then they also do it where if you subscribe for more than just one month at a time, then you will get a discount on all of your boxes as a whole type of a thing. You can select the regular box size, which will have 7 to 10 items in it, or else you can get the large box size, and that will have 10 to 14 items in it. So there will also be a price difference there, and then they also do it where if you subscribe for more than just one month at a time, then you will get a discount on all of your boxes as a whole type of a thing. If you just sign up for the one month at a time, it'll be $24.99 per box for the regular size, and then if you sign up for the 12 month plan it'll be $20 flat for the boxes all throughout the year. They do free shipping worldwide so that's like included in your subscription or whatever and yeah it's a lot of fun if you enjoy trying out treats from around the world and specifically Japan since this is a Japanese treats box type of a thing. They did provide me with a discount code if you want to sign up for the box or anything. It doesn't get me any sort of a kickback or money or anything it's just purely well a so that they can see how many people went to their site from this video of mine and then B it just gets you money off so it's a win-win I guess at least I would see it as such also they just like revamped their website PS it looks really good just so you know wow box just so you know I would say you did a good job I didn't think it looked bad before but it's just it looks really good all right guys Give me the treats! So they have these little like mascot type things now so the box is super duper cute and it's got the card here. I'm so excited! So here we go. Here are the treats. I'm so excited. I do believe they send me the large box. I... <sighs> are these like rice cakes? Are they like... I don't know! I don't know! There's rice right there, so I'm thinking rice cakes, but I'm excited. I'm in the mood for something crunchy right now. Oh no, one of them came a little broken. Poor little guy. But here we go. I'll eat the broken one, or part of the broken one. Just because. You know, why not? So it's... Hmm. Hmm. Yum. That tastes like a mix between a rice cake, like a Quaker rice cake, and then like a cheesy poof. Can I? I'm gonna... Mmm. 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 Yep. It's like exactly what I wanted right now. Oh. Just salty and crunchy. And airy and light. Ooh, I'm gonna eat those very quickly. Mmm. <laughs> Can't stop, won't stop. It came with five of the little cracker cake things in there. So if Wowbox offers, like um, a lot of subscription boxes do, where you know the stuff that they send to you, they'll have it available for purchase on their website. I would order those for sure. Oh, yum, 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 yum. A drink? Ururu. I don't know. Isn't that kind of like the... Ururu. Isn't that like a... Is that boro boro? 
I don't know. And this is yuzu flavored. Yuzu is a type of fruit. So, okay. I mean, I get it. Okay, so it's not carbonated at all, which is probably good considering, you know, it's shipped in a box. Ooh, it smells refreshing. Ooh, super refreshing. I am excited to put this in the fridge. It's going to be even better when it's cold. But mmm, very light, very crisp, very yuzu. Mmm. I don't know, if you've never had yuzu before, it's kind of like a clementine, but like more mild, I think. And yay, I see another soy joy. I got one of these in the last box that they sent to me. This is a soy joy crispy though, and this is pudain, so it's a plain flavor, but I really, really liked the soy joy bar that they had sent to me in the first box that they sent to me. So I'm curious to see what their plain flavor tastes like. They're just kind of like little uh, biscuit cookies. So, see? Mmm. Mm-hmm. Yeah. Mmm. Okay, yeah, it's really good. It's just very plain tasting, like a plain almost buttery biscuit, but not very buttery. It's got more of like a sweet almond extract or like vanilla extract kind of a flavor to it. It's good. I could see it being really good with like a coffee or something in the morning. And then we've got himo himo candy. So whatever himo himo means, candy. <laughs> oh, I see. So I bet these are like the individual flavors, the two kinds of aji in the different colors there, and then together they make a peach flavor. Okay, <laughs> so they're just these little strings, and I don't know, are you supposed to twist them together? Maybe? Why not? Who doesn't like to play with their food? Come on now, even as an adult. We all have our moments. Do I be dainty about it, or do I just like shove the whole thing in my mouth? <laughs> oh, is this gum? Oops. Oh, maybe not. It has the consistency of like that bubble tape. So I was thinking it was gum. I don't think it's gum. <laughs> I hope not. I just swallowed it, so. It's good. I'm not the biggest grape fan. But something I noticed, at least in like this and then in the last box where they had some grape stuff, their grape flavors are more of like a Concord grape flavor, so I like it better than like American grape flavored candies. I hate grape flavored things, so. Moving on. Neru neru. Oh, is this another? Nakayoshi neru neru. So like, nakayoshi, isn't that like kind of like making friends or like friendly? things. So I think this is just one of those kit things. Yes it is. It's got instructions on the back so if you want me to I can do a separate video on this. I still have to do a separate video on that other one that I got from them. The last one that I got this wow box. But uh yeah I can. I can. <laughs> so if you want me to do those videos let me know and I can definitely do that. Ooh are these the same ones? Yes they are. These are so good. These are the Veggie pusu, so like a mix between veggie and chips. Negi, kabocha, and jagaimo, which is potato, pumpkin, and onion. And these are so good. I really, I tried these the last time on camera, so like I don't need to open this up again and try them for you, but like. <laughs> these are so good. So there you can see, like it's got the different stuff, so. Some of those are the kabocha, and some of them are just like the regular kind of potato chips, and then the oniony chips. They definitely all have like a... Ow. Mmm. They've got like a overall very like salty oniony taste to them. Mmm. But they're so good. Oh my gosh, I need to stop. Mmm. They're so good. Like, I could eat these every single day and not be sad about it at all. Can I have just, just one more? It's for the video. Mmm. Just so crunchy and delicious. Ooh! So this is Tohato Caramel Corn. So caramel corn. Yay! 
right. I'm so excited. I just love Japanese packaging. It's like, look at this little guy. A little rhino? Is that a rhino? Like, you're so cute. I like this thing. What is, I don't know what that is, but it's so cute. It's also very hard to open. Mm. <laughs> Good thing I've got scissors. Ooh, it looks so poofy. Ooh, and it smells so sweet. Yum. Okay, let's find out. So they're just in these little U shapes. Oh my gosh. You know when you eat something and you're like, it's beautiful. I feel like I'm putting little bits of heaven in my mouth. Oh my god. Oh, okay. I was kind of getting that flavor. So here it says, Kokonatsu Miriku. And then I don't know what that last character is, but it's got a coconut milk flavor to it. It really is. It's like a caramely, coconutty flavor and like in a cheese poof form. Just, those are delicious. A plus, A plus on those. What was the brand name? Tohato. You done good. Oh, look cute. Here we've got some Hello Kitty themed, I believe these are Pocky type things. Ichigo Puretsuru. So these are actually strawberry pretzels. That's interesting. I wasn't expecting that. So here we go. They don't look like pretzels. They just look like little biscuits. But like, look at the Hello Kitty all over. It's so cute. Did I mention this was the Kawaii and Beauty box? So that's why everything is like kind of cutesy and whatnot. And there you go. It's just a nice thin little biscuit looking thing. And it looks like it's got the strawberry flavor. ever had yan yan it tastes like that like the little cookies and you dip it in the strawberry so yummy very delicious those will definitely get eaten hey pikachu these feel like gummies i don't know why but it's showing some evolution stuff on the back here so we've got Pikachu and then going into Raichu. Raichu was always one of my favorites. It's got the Kaminari no Ishi. And it's got other Pokemon that I'm assuming are like new Pokemon that I don't know who they are. Oh, there's Gengar and Alakazam on here. Okay, I know who they are. But like, I don't know who these guys are under the flap. I didn't even read what these are supposed to be. So there's a soda, there's a pink grapefruit, and then there's a lemon. Oh, and so it's going with the Pokemon thing. Like if you put them together, it'll evolve into a different flavor. I get it. So they're just like these little squishy gummies. Mmm, that's a delicious little gummy. Let's try a combo. If I do a soda and a pink grapefruit, it'll taste like cola. That's interesting. So we've got the soda and a pink grapefruit. And if I put them together, Mm-hmm. Weird. Oh, weird. Mm-hmm. It tastes like cola. It's really reminiscent of uh, cola schnecke. So like the little uh, soda snails, like the Coca-Cola snails. We've got a couple more things. Ooh. Okay, so I don't think this is going to be something that I'm going to eat right now, but this is pure inner support collagen things. Um, like I said, this is the kawaii and beauty box, so every now and then they'll have like a beauty item in there, so cool. I mean, why not? Start out young. Prevention is key, correct? And last but not least here, ooh, this looks yummy. So it's some kind of a bar. Let's see. Some sort of a lemon and something. Lemon Piru, so lemon peel, choco chipu. Oh, so it's lemon peel and white chocolate. Ho oh, ho, oh, oh. <laughs> That sounds delicious. I'm very curious. 
to see if it actually is. I'm sure it will be, considering everything else that I've eaten. Again, <laughs> for some reason, I'm really bad at opening these packages. The plastic just feels stronger than American plastic. <laughs> and like the adhesive, my goodness. There we go. It's like a beautiful little fruit cheesecake bar almost. It's got a little graham cracker on it on the bottom. Ooh, ooh. Mmm. Mmm. It's so good. That is delicious. Mm-hmm. I'm so sorry. Don't look at me right now. Mmm. Mmm. Oh my gosh, I don't want to put it away. It's so good. It's just got a really light, fluffy lemon cheesecake kind of a flavor to it. Just... Mmm. Yum, yum! This was such a delicious box, oh my gosh! 11 items in that box, and lots of like big items. I mean like this freaking bottle here, and a big bag of these angel poof delights. I'm so happy, so happy and excited to eat all of these things later. That may or may not be in one sitting, like oh my god. So good. I can't even pick a favorite. Everything was delicious. This bar, and these coconut things, and then the veggie chips, and then the cracker thingy, and then the yuzu drink. <laughs> Isn't that like everything that came in this box? Thank you so much again to Wowbox for sending me another one of your boxes. It was delicious. If any of you guys want to sign up, like I said, they did provide me with a code. You can use it, you cannot, you know, that's totally your prerogative. I just think this is such a great subscription service. Like, I don't know, something about the food ones, you know? It's like, you get so many beauty boxes or like so many of this, so many of that. It's like, you can only have so much stuff, but like food is something you need every single day. So like, I know I'm gonna eat all this stuff eventually. I don't, I don't know. I just, I think it's so fun to try foods from around the world and everything. This was just, it was a lot of fun again. So thanks once again to Wowbox. Congrats again on your one year anniversary and also for the revamp of your website. It really does, it looks great. And if you guys enjoyed the video, please do go ahead and give me a thumbs up down below. I would really appreciate it. And if you're new here, hey, hi, hello, how are ya? You can go ahead and subscribe if you want to see more content from me in the future. I'd love to have you here. And as always, I just hope you guys are all doing well. And until next time, just stay well until then. Bye!